to you act and know that what you're doing is correct, the lab is one of the best ways you can get that done. So once again, we will hard code these to switch port mode of access and spanning tree, BPDU guard, enabled. So that about covers basic spanning tree security features. Uh, just to, to recap here, on our port channel, one trunk between the distribution layer switches, we set up dynamic tr trunking protocol to no negotiate, so it, uh, well, theoretically bypasses DTP and uh, allows a rogue switch to, that might be connected to one of those ports uh, to not create that that uh, trunk there so it's not going to send uh, those DTP packets across there to try and create a connection where uh, the Cisco default configuration is dynamic desirable so if one end tries to essentially start uh, a trunk there it's going to go ahead and accept it. We set the storm control for broadcast to a uh, level of 50% so suppression level there. We also talked about where to apply root guard, uh, what interfaces, where they should be facing, how that can go wrong. We also talked about uh, applying BPDU guard on the correct interfaces, shutting down unused ports, and hard coding access mode ports on our access layer switches. If you have any questions, you can always email me at bowlermj at yahoo.com. You can check out my YouTube channel as well as my brother's YouTube channel. He's got some uh, some Switchport security labs. He, he is bowlersp over at YouTube, and he's got several lab volumes that you can uh, go ahead and purchase from him. A lot of good information there. And I hope this lab has helped you, and uh, I'd like to see you in my future labs. Thanks.